Hello, Agents Undercover Cops and Law Enforcers. Welcome back to Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands and Playing Hardball. So here we are, Todos Santos. I drove off camera a little bit down the road. Uh, and here we can, we know that uh, we got the information that uh, there is some intel here and there is actually a helicopter in the town. So, that is what we want to get, right? So we can actually get some other stuff done for which we need. some help civilians in there the drone is up let's have a drone fly up just to have an overview not just civilians ah, actually there's even a rebel area A lady. That's fine. So, house is clear. Let's sneak up. Although these guys are not hostiles. Oh yeah. Hola, buenas. Todo bien, todo bien. What's this? A legend. Oh, a silver coin. The silver mines of Bolivia have been exploited since the Spanish conquest in the 16th century. The most famous of them is Cerro Rico, the rich mountain in Potosi. The labor force was once composed of natives and African slaves. Working in extreme conditions, millions died extracting the precious metal. Despite a steep decline in activity in the past 40 years, these mines are still exploited today and miners remain a significant social and cultural component of Bolivia. Okay, interesting. So now... For the helicopter. Actually, okay, we're guys, cool. we're just saving some time. It's quick travel. We're just uh, having a little stroll through the night to this rebel uh, hideout, and they have a helicopter at our disposal, so it's fine. We don't need to draw any further attention at the moment, so that's fine. There we are. Yeah, viva la revolución. I'll pilot. Actually, we can Let's do this ride. one. Okay, so far I've never used the spotting ability. But it also never failed necessarily. Let the rebels know where it is so they can pick it up. Whew. Here, I thought you might want us to carry the damn thing out of here ourselves. Ah, 
Uh, now we can actually get this one. Santa Muerte Tomb. Ah, let's do that one. Now that we are so close, everybody on board. Yes, excellent. Where they think that airborne. we are some carteleros. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Okay, one is come is uh, checking in on us. Got a tango. I got a third. Got eyes on the captain. That's another one. Well, the heavily armed guys will probably not give up, but uh, still, it could be a good idea to take this guy. Roger, out. let me get in position. Let me get into position. Copy that. Moving. Roger. Target marked. Lost Copy. my target. Target the marked. Target. Ready to engage. Okay, guys, take them out. Got it. Okay, we're still all right. It looks like there is no one else anyway, so... Let's use night vision. Oh, there is someone. That LT is getting away. No, that doesn't matter. Shit, they're headed this way. What should we do? We are taking them out. Well, guys, Open you're allowed fire. to fire, fire at will. Roger that. Enemy down. Fire, fire, fire. There we go. Some rebels to help, excellent. So there are some supplies here, but let's get the intel first. Okay, well, food. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. There it is. Another Happy document. New Year, Karen. I'm guessing you had a Bolivian Christmas too. You know, Sueño doesn't really get into the holiday spirit the way most people do. Another day, I was driving him around Bukhara. He had me stop on this hill out of the middle of buff fuck nowhere. And he shows me these blueprints for his own mausoleum. <laughs> I don't know, I guess he's planning his fucking legacy or something. But anyway, the mausoleum, it's fucking epic. And I'm like, Efe, that tomb is fit for a goddamn king. It's when your turns that gigantic fucking head to me and says, completely straight-faced, cold as stone, Ricky, that's a tomb for a god. <laughs> Can you believe the megalomania on this guy? He just wears it around like a hat. Like it's no big deal that he thinks he's a fucking divine being walking among the goddamn mortals. My mother always told me I should be more confident. Maybe 
I should take a page from the big dog's book. Grow an ego the size of Russia. I bet you like that. I'll roll up into an RP. I don't know, have you rearranged the furniture to fit my divine design? But the mausoleum is gonna be a big construction project and fucking artisans and craftsmen and, you know, guys who know stuff are making all this expensive replica shit. Or maybe he's gonna start importing art. Anyway, stick a pin in it. I'm just saying, this big project in Pukhara is something you want to have on your radar. Okay, well, we will disturb it. Uh, let's make a tour like around here and then we are also nearly done with the mission. Let's get this one next. Block one of the station's entrances, that's good. But that, my dear fellow agents, we will see in the next episode. So, if you like this one, be straightforward. A little thing getting in there, not getting shot this time, that's great. Uh, yeah, I appreciate it. Click the like button. You're very welcome to join the channel as well if you haven't done so yet. So you never will miss an episode again. So next time, bye.